My favorite part of the program is that the focus of it is really not on service delivery and sort of the experience of, of getting to practice medicine somewhere else. The focus of the program is really about information exchange and working with our partners and being flexible to what they want from us. My name is Colleen Fant. I'm an attending in the Division of Pediatric Emergency Medicine here at Lurie Children's. Lurie Children's is really dedicated to the healthy health of children in their communities, and that is something that we work on both here in Chicago as well as, as globally. Our pediatric residents have the opportunity to travel to a clinic in Bolivia and spend some time there. They can also go to a teaching hospital in western Tanzania called Bugondo and spend a rotation there as well. The rotation in Bolivia that our residents can do it's a lot more about learning about the community-based medicine that occurs there and actually getting to see um, some patients. Whereas our rotation in Tanzania is a little bit more about education information exchange and our residents spend about a month there on the wards observing, learning, and then using their education and knowledge that they've obtained during their residency here to share some of those skills with the pediatric residents and Bugando and the medical students there. So they really focus on teaching and doing simulation cases and sort of building some of that educational capacity. We do some educational modules, we do some simulation cases to prepare the residents before they travel. Um, and then we also do provide funding for the residents to do that. There's a bi-directional exchange to it. So while our residents have been going to Bugando Medical Center in, in Wanza, Tanzania for, for years now, in turn, we actually host their pediatric residents here at Lurie Children's for a month long rotation and they get to participate in our grand rounds, our morning reports, and sort of um, kind of learn from our care here. So our global health program is, is pretty flexible and it really depends on the interest of each residency class. So anywhere from, you know, there may be one or two rotations a year where it's a month long rotation uh, with anywhere from like two to five residents who can go. Um, to many, many trips a year if, if there's more interest in the class. And, and that's the nice thing is, is since we have this long-term relationship there, they're a little bit more willing to be flexible with us. Really, I think what we're trying to do is cultivate a group of global citizens um, who are using and leveraging their skills that they develop as pediatricians and pediatric specialists and be able to kind of share that with our peers who are also seeing children in any other part of the world. It builds sort of empathy, it builds interpersonal skills, the ability to sort of communicate across cultures and language barriers, um, which I think is, is invaluable to anyone uh, taking care of children and families. Our pediatric residents here are able to participate in the McGaw Global Health Clinical Scholars Tract, um, which is this really neat program that I'm also in the leadership for. In addition to helping support their, their travel and the global health experience, it's a two-year program that really has this educational scaffold behind it uh, to help them get the most out of their experience. So we do lectures, we do peer journal clubs, and we have a pretty uh, intense simulation curriculum with it where we work with the residents pretty closely and we do ethics simulation cases. We review some basic life-saving skills that we think would be useful when they're working in resource-limited settings. And we also do simulation around decision-making and really being thoughtful uh, global citizens while they travel.